Hello, I welcome you all to this wonderful lesson. And in this lesson, we've got this question that I want to revise with you. This question is falling under vectors. So this question that came in 2023 ECZ exams. So how can we answer this particular question? So wherever you are watching this video from, these are just the same. And the way in which I'm going to answer this question, you are going to understand. So I remember I gave this question to the people that I do help online. So I just want us to revise this question together with them. So the question is saying, the diagram shows a trapezium OABC. So this is a trapezium OABC in which OA, vector OA is equal to 2A. So vector OA is equal to 2A. Vector OC is equal to 3C. OC is equal to 3C. And vector AB, we've got vector AB is equal to 3OC, meaning that uh, this line OC is entering in there three times. This is the meaning. So just to summarize this part, I see this part gets to confuse a lot of people so 3 OC. So before I go any further to interpret this, this before it confuses someone, 3 OC. So if I say 3, I will write it there. Then OC. OC is this one. So OC like this. This is just the same as 3 OC. I know that it is what? 3C. Have you seen? So when I multiply 3 times 3, I'm getting a 9. So meaning that what is here, what is on top here, this is just the same as 9C, vector 9C. So this is a B. To answer that, I don't want to confuse anyone or to leave any person behind. So I've just interpreted that. So this is the same as 3, then 3C, which is just equal to what? 9C. So Vector AB is equal to 9C. So I think we are done with that. So that this should not confuse us. And D is the midpoint of AC. We've got D here, which is the midpoint of line AC. So let us now answer these questions together. We've got the first question here that's saying find AC. So I'm going to write it here. We want to find AC. So I told you that the way we get to move, we move in a triangle way and we just need to move two steps when we are going to a specific direction so a c you are not supposed to start with c i'm, I'm telling you that you move from a to c you can't start with c you can't say that you say c or you can't do that this is not allowed you start with what they have started with so i noticed some people that are under my online lessons they were starting with c you don't do that. I think even when I was teaching on a live, I told you. You start with A. So, A, O, O, C. This is how you are going to move. If you want, you can move A, B, B, C. The question is, do you have the B, C? No, you don't have. So, you cannot use this one. This one is not given. So, you go to where you are given. You are going to move A, O, A, O, Plus what? O, C. O, C. This is what you are going to do. So we get to move this strategically, not anyhow. So you say A, C, vector A, C is equal to, what is A, O? A, O. We are going against this vector. So whenever you are going against a vector, you put a negative. So it is negative what? Negative 2, A. Like this, negative vector 2, A. A plus what is OC? OC is 3C. It is what? 3C. Vector 3C. So I don't want to confuse anyone. I can end here. There is no problem. I don't want to confuse anyone. We are learning this gradually. So I don't want to confuse anyone. Hope you are able to see what is happening. This is what I'm doing. So you need to make sure that you follow through. This can also be written as 
it can also be you start with this one so we can start with this where i'm going to do that this is the same as 3c minus 2a vector 2a like this this is just one and the same hope you are able to see what i've just written down there so that is one and the same so we make sure that we understand that part you even know how to go about that we move to the other question we are done with this so they give you a mark we move to question two two is saying od you find od how can you find od od where is od od it is not given you put a line there od this is the od that you want to find how can you find od for you to find od you are going to say o b i mean o a a d this is how you are going to move if you want you can move this way o c c d but if you move this way it's more like you are going this other side so the line you are going to consider is this line which you are going to say that is c a so since we are going to get the negative of this because you'll be going against this it is better you move this way a o a it's better you move this way o a plus vector what a d a d it is better you move this way i believe you are all able to see what is happening you are able to follow through so a d such that if i consider this i'll get this all line i'll start from here a c which is here the a c is here so i'm going to say o d is then equal to what is o a o a is 2 a so i say 2 a this is what i'm going to do plus what is a d what is a d a d is what the half of a c because i'm told that this is the midpoint so a d is half of which line half of which line a c so a c half of the line a c i know what a c is i can therefore so this is equal to 2 a plus 1 over 2 what is a c i've got this this is what 2 negative 2 a plus 3 c i can do that this is just one and the same hope you are able to see you are able to see what is happening and what i'm doing these are things that you are supposed to do. Where I'm going to say that this is now equal to, this is 2a. Have you seen positive or negative? I'll get a negative here. Since I'm getting a negative, what will happen is that this is, I'm going to have 1 times 2. I'm going to have 2 over, down here I've got a 2. Then I'm going to have what? A. 2 divided by 2, it is 1. So instead of saying 1a, it is better just say a. Have you seen? Hope you've seen. You are going to have something like this. You are going to have negative one times two, two a over two. So two over two, it's one. So instead of saying negative one a, we say negative a. Then this positive and that positive, it is as positive. One times three, it is three over two. Then a c comes there. Finally, we now have our answer. O d is now equal to what is our O d? Two. A, have you seen 2a minus a? What answer are we getting here? What answer am I going to get here? I'm going to get a plus. So vector a, 2, the coefficient here is 1. 2 minus 1, it is 1. Since that is a, I'm going to say a. I can't say 1a. Plus, this side is 3 over 2, then vector c. This is what I'm supposed to do. That is the answer so that one down here that is the answer these are procedures that are supposed to be done i believe you are able to see what is happening you are able to follow through all the procedures that i'm doing here so now i go to the other part so this is the answer i think you've seen how i've answered this you've seen how i've answered let us move now to the other part so let me do this hope you've seen how i was answering that so let me create more space here 
let me do this i create more space so i move to this one i want to find o b how can i find o b so o b a line this have you seen so you want to find o b this is o b that you want to find o what o b how can you find o b so o b o b how can you move so these things are very simple how can you move you are going to say o a o a plus a b plus a what plus a b this is what you're going to say which is equal to what is o a o a you are going with a vector this is 2a 2a plus what is a b a b it is this one we found 9c 9c so meaning that this is your answer you just end there that is the answer that you get so these are things that you are supposed to do these are things that you need to understand i think you are able to see all the procedures that i'm doing you are able to follow through i move to this one i find bd i find now what bd how can i find bd from here b is here to this point here how can i find that i say this this and that have you seen this is what i'm going to do so what i'm going to say is that for me to find bd the last one bd how i'm going to move is that i'm going to say b a so i'm going to say b a vector b a plus a d plus a d this is how i'm going to move so this is how you are supposed to do hope you are able to see what i'm doing you are able to see the procedures that i'm doing here you say b d is now equal to what is b a b a you are now going against have you seen this is it means it is going that other way but if we are going against so it is equal to what negative 9c then what is our ad our ad what is our ad ad where is ad ad is here where was ad ad how can we find ad so ad is just half of this line have you seen ad or somewhere here ad how can we find ad was there half of this line half of what ac so half of ac half of ac half of ac ad is from here to there but this all line is ac so i'm just going to evaluate that part so that is negative 9c plus half what is ac ac what is my ac ac was here i found it was this this was the answer so this is what the way it is like this this is a negative uh, 2a plus 3c so negative 2a plus 3c this is what you are supposed to do so let me continue from here so that you just see what is happening so just see what is happening so this is the bd so bd is equal to negative 9c half times that have you seen half times that half times negative 2 so then one times negative 2 you are going to have negative 2 over 2 then a negative positive positive that is positive 1 times 3 that is plus 3 over 2 then my c comes there so these are vectors i put something down there so this is what it is what i'm doing here i'm multiplying this times that this times that so what gets to multiply is the numerator i think uh, you know this what gets to multiply is the numerator so numerator will multiply one times two it is two over two one times three it's three over two this is what you're supposed to do i here i group like terms so i'm going to have bd vector bd is equal to negative nine c this one comes plus what two three over two c if i divide here this is not a negative this is vector c so if i divide here i'm getting a one so it's minus what minus a i can't say minus one a i evaluate this part 
how then do we evaluate that part? I just consider the coefficients. So I just consider the coefficients. That is negative 9 plus 3 over 2. What is the lowest common denominator here? It is 2. Here I say 1. 1 times 1 into 2, 2. 2 times negative 9, negative 18. I say plus 2 into 2, 1. 1 plus 1 times 3, that is 3. Have you seen like this? 2 into 2, 1. 1 times 3, 3. Here when we add, we get negative 15 over what? Over 2. So this is the answer. I just put a C there. So where I'm going to say that therefore, BD is equal to, the answer that I'm getting is negative 15 over 2C vector C minus A. This is the answer that I'm getting. So these are the procedures that you're supposed to do. These are things that you need to know and understand. So this is vector what? This is vector A. And that is vector C. So we end here. Those of you that wants to join me, those of you that wants to join my online lessons, you are free to text me on this number. This is my WhatsApp number. This is the line that you need to text. This is my WhatsApp number. So my online lessons are done using Telegram. So I teach using Telegram. So even as you are texting, you need to make sure that you download Telegram. Telegram is just like an app, like WhatsApp. But Telegram mostly is good for online lessons because it has a lot of features for lessons that can be done online. So make sure that you download it on Presto there, Telegram, you download it there. So we end here. If you are looking for tuitions, this is my number, plus 260971 Thank you so much. This is your tutor, tutor, Addison J. Zuru.